What's up people, Manor here, coming to you with a video. This time I'm going to be showing you how to make yogurt that is not runny and that can even be cut with a knife. You can make it in an Instapot, you can also make it in a Ninja Foodi or you can make it in a household oven. All you need is a container that is preferably ceramic container, a little bit uh, thick that can hold on to the heat and you need whole milk. Uh, step one fill up the container to the top level and any container that you get make sure it has a lid available it doesn't have to be necessarily airtight just something that can cover it once you have that done once you have the milk measured till the almost the top reason being we want to minimize the air gap you take that milk and you put it in a big container and you bring it to a roaring boil uh, do it at a slow pace that way you don't have the milk burning on the bottom. Once the milk does come to a full boil, once it actually does start rising, uh, what you need to do is you need to put the milk on the side and let it cool down to about 120 degrees Fahrenheit or till the time it's cold to touch to some degree but it's not, it should not be cold. Basically something similar to what you will be able to feed to an infant. You want that temperature of a milk. And this is what I mean by a roaring boil. The milk will literally almost boil over. That's when you need to turn it off and let the milk temperature drop. Make sure to cover it that way nothing falls in it. And to prevent the milk from burning uh, too quickly, I use a tawa, as you can see. I put that underneath to boil it. And I use this kind of a sieve uh, to cover the milk. Let it naturally cool down. Uh, don't put it in the fridge. Leave it out on the counter for about uh, one or two hours. I leave the link in the video description on where you can find this from Amazon. All right, once the milk is about 120 degrees, just put a scoop, like one spoon, one tablespoon of uh, yogurt. Preferably use a Greek yogurt cause it's much better. This is the brand I'm using. Uh, use full fat yogurt or, or partial fat yogurt. Uh, it actually definitely works. Once you do that, just take a spoon, don't stir it up, just drop it very slowly and then put the entire container in a warm place. You can put the light on in your oven and put it in. In six hours, you'll have yogurt. And this yogurt, as you can see, you're able to cut the dang thing. And it's super delicious. Let me put it back. And that's how it's easy so, uh, it's to make. I won't recommend serving it warm. Just put it in the fridge and then enjoy. As always, thank you so much for watching. Like, comment, subscribe. And I'll see you guys and girls on the next video. Take care, people.